Have you been to Bucky's in Florida? It's right off 95 exit. 323. 323, and it's huge. Look at all these pumps. And on the other side of the building, there's just as many. There's a huge uh, convenience store. It's more like a department store. You can get all kinds of stuff in there. I'm going to take you on a tour. If you're passing through in this area, you should stop at Bucky's. It's like an attraction, right, honey? Hell yeah. <laughs> Follow us. <laughs> Along with my dreams. Bucky's, not your average gas station or convenience store. The store is like a mall. You can do all your Christmas shopping. It's like the coolest thing ever. This is just an experience to stop here. It's like an attraction. Have you ever seen so many ice machines at a gas station? Never. And you can buy your smoker grills. Bucky's was founded in 1982 in Texas. The first store was only 3,000 square feet. The name Bucky's was inspired by the owner's longtime nickname Beaver and his beloved lab Buck. So he named the store Bucky's with a cartoon character Beaver as the mascot. Bucky's has now grown to over 43 locations around the nation. We visited the one in to St. Augustine. We were on a trip to North Carolina, so we didn't stay over very long, but Bucky's is a place where you can go and visit and spend hours. This store was 55,000 square feet, so you need a lot of time for sightseeing. Bucky's is like the Disney World of gas stations. There are over 104 fueling stations and 70 flavors of fountain drinks lots and lots of choices they have a huge selection of jerky they, they're known for their cleanest restrooms the freshest food and the friendliest staff and i would agree with all those it's really really a very very cool stopover or just make a trip and and go to visit one of the buckies nearby there's two in Florida. There's the one we stopped at in St. Augustine, and there's also one into Daytona Beach. But now there are 43 all across the country. So with the largest one being in Texas, the largest one is over 65,000 square feet, I believe. So this is truly a place to stop at. And you can go with your RV in there. I saw signs, no semis, but I'm pretty sure that you can go with your RV. We saw some smaller RVs fuel on, fueling up in there. We had lunch, we had the, the brisket. It was very fresh. The barbecue sauce they use is delicious. We had such a good experience at Bucky's. So we highly recommend you stopping over at Bucky's or just going for a visit one day. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so that you won't miss our weekly videos. See you on the road.